How's it going everyone? My name is Ruskai and I'll be showing off this Groudon EX decklist. Uh, it's basically a Mega Gryogre, uh, Groudon, Grad but you call it Primal Groudon EX, okay? Um, this card has 240 HP and has an attack that does 100 plus 100 more if there is a stadium in play and then you discard that stadium. Um, at this look, it doesn't, it's not the best card, but it has a lot of good partners and you can part all these cards together and then you get a lot of damage. Um, one thing that you have to look at is this barrier trait. So whenever your opponent plays a, trading, a train of cards, um, you prevent all the damn effects on that Pokemon, this Pokemon. So that means a boss sword, a Lysander, doesn't work on this. If they play it, they, they just play it. You, you see the card coming from their hand, it's laying next to their active. And nothing happens, the card just goes to the, the, the discard and nothing happens. <laughs> That's what happens when they play against the Gradle. Uh, most of the people don't know about it because it's an old card, it's 2014. But it's so much fun to play with. And I love Gradle on its own, so yeah. Um, and you can boost its damage by a lot. Um, you can boost it with Diancy, so it does 20 damage more. You can boost it with this Martial Art Dojo, it can do up to 40 damage more. So these two combine already 60, 260 damage. And then you also have 4 these strong energy imagine if you have attached four to this crowd which would not happen but all right then you have, would do 80 damage more plus 20 plus 40 so that means 140 damage more so that means 340 damage with all of that in just one hit which will never happen okay and that's not the point of this the whole point actually of this deck is to play with hit one chan it does 30 damage and you switch this with one of your benched pokemon you can switch it out with dolls i have four dolls i have five dolls four dolls and one rowboat so that means that we have five dolls in total and then we also have this wall of Hat, which prevents all the abilities from all of your opponent's pokemon as long as it's in the active spot so you can just place it there in the active spot with a floating stone in your hand or whatever and yeah, they can't use anything like the Dene or Chaimin, whatever, un uh, until it's gone out of the active spot. So yeah, that's pretty good. So you actually keep playing with this, and believe me, this 30 damage here can turn into 90 or even 110 pretty easily. It happens almost every game. Because you do 20 more with this, so that's 50, plus like a strong energy, so you would already be doing... Uh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> um, 70 damage and then if you have the stadium in play you would even do more damage so that's how you boost that damage and uh, yeah it will really add up each turn um it's also really nice if you hit weakness but all right so what we play as trainer cards here is an edgy recycle um yeah only one a field blower in case they have something like a chaotic swell or some tool cards that we don't want so yeah that's the reason why it's here then we have a crate catcher for those Dennis. Then we have four Lily Dolls. We also have three Nest Balls, two Professor Sulettas, one Robot. Then we also have three Versus Seekers. And those were all the items. Now we have move on to our stadium. So, so we use two Martial Arts, two Power Plants, and then one um, Scorched Earth. Uh, this one here, if you don't know it, you discard a uh, fire or fighting energy from your hands and if you do you draw two cards so yeah that's a good um, that's a good card to get some extra draws going we use two copies of Cynthia one of Cynthia and Caitlyn one Guzma and Hala so this Guzma works on your ground because it's your trainer card okay it's only your opponent's cards that don't work on that ground so yeah you can get out your Guzma there then we also have one Guzma and Hala and then we run Corina. This card here, if you don't know it, you search your deck for a fighting Pokemon and an energy card and reveal them and put them into your hands. So that's a really, really good card in almost any fighting deck. We also run two copies of N and two Steven Revolt and Resolves. A lot of supporters if you look at it, but most of them only have one, 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 one. So it's alright. Then we also have four um, tool cards, so two floating stones and two spirit links. And then we have four, no, in total five special energies. So one weakness guard, and then four strong energies. This energy uh, makes your opponent's attacks do 20 more for each energy attached to that Pokemon. Uh, each of those strong energies, okay? So if you attach one strong energy to your Pokemon, it does 20 more damage. That's very, very good energy. Um, and I hope it will come back in some way. We now have powerful en energy for the normal type Pokemon. So it does 20 damage more if it's a normal type. 
and that's what it is actually it's basically this one but i like this one more <laughs> and then we run in total seven fighting energies uh these energies um yeah they work they work so yeah that was the deck list and uh now enjoy some gameplay of it cheers so we start off with throwing our coin it's a grass deck which means it's a weakness i mean it shows grass which is just completely nonsense but right the good thing about this is if that's the sitch why we don't really like have problems with it because it doesn't block anything from us but it is our weakest and that's true Alrighty. aha okay very interesting so it's gonna have this fire suite evolved into a serena so very very nice yeah. So what we are gonna do is attach this energy there because the chance of us pulling a strong energy next turn could be very high. By the way, I love this promo card. It's so cool. Just look at this. It's a basic, a basic outline, for example. Just all these wonderful, shiny things, sides. It's just absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So this Torina here, once during your turn, you may attach a grass energy burn this going on to walk to your active Pokemon. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Not really uh, much to say about that. Okay, let's see if we can get something. Uh, too bad, too bad. Thing is, with Torina, uh, with Corina, you can find, um, you can find both fighting Pokemon and a doll. Because the doll was basically a, a, a knight's card. So yeah, that's pretty cool. So, we didn't find anything. Um, what we will do is put another Hitmonchan here. Okay. So, what I'm gonna do is get this Warp Fit there. So you can't use this ability. Because we're gonna get uh, a tool card next turn with the Karina. Because the tool card is basically an item card. But just with the other things that our tool has. So yeah, we did 60 damage there. We got what, 10 damage from this, 20 damage from this, and then 20 damage here. If we had a strong energy, that would already have add up to 80 damage, which is actually a lot. Don't underestimate it, man. Don't do it. Ooh, Butterbrief. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Okay, what I'm gonna do is attach this one there. Get a Karina. And then we get ourselves a um, float, float uh, stone. Yeah, float stone. Um, what we can do is. Something like a professor's. I oh, know. <laughs> we have to get a Pokemon. Alright, and a Primal Groudon. It is. We should be able to evolve it, but I want to attack. I want to attack. We need a Spirit Link to evolve it. I don't want to lose my attack, my attack power. Oh, I should have actually gone for the Robo. But that's alright actually, because then I block their, their abilities. Heal 90 damage from your active Pokemon. Oof. That's a lot. Take a look, and there's a lovely bunny. <laughs> blocks 50, 150 uh, Blocks 40 damage, or something like that. Okay, so he healed up all the damage on his Pokemon. Bad news, bad news. And if he, if he pulls up that stupid GX, oh no, that's gonna be very, very bad news then. So we get ourselves the Spirit Link, and. Uh, I hit one channel again, I guess. Alright, so we attach the spirit link. Oh, 
we didn't. Okay, uh, we don't have any energies in our disco pile at the moment. So we can't start attaching energies, that's stupid. Okay, so just so he knows, I have to do N. Okay. So that's a 90 damage. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's 40 or something like that. Uh, and then we'll get ourselves the Robo Institute there. Now, we will hope that he uses. Ah, oh, okay. Wow, this is like a healing deck. We haven't seen any strong energies yet. So he's basically healing all the damage that he has received. Ooh, what can we get out? What should we do? Start attacking something else? What does this do? When you attach this... Ah yeah, okay, you heal 30 damage from that Pokemon. Okay, okay. But what I'm gonna do is... No, no, I don't, I don't have any switches. Okay, then I'm just gonna use N. I give him cards though, that's bad, but... We got ourselves another doll. And a Professor Letter. It's really frustrating that we didn't have... We can't find any strong energies. We have four in the deck and we haven't seen one. We just have not seen one. Alright. Need to run that thing again. So he's getting up that V card, V Max card, but a free V. Bruh, how many cards does this deck have that are heals? Um, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be, uh, very aggressive on this part now, I think, I think, should I do that? No, 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 that's, that's, that's very risky, yeah, yeah, it's too risky, okay. Um, we do have this energy, but I don't want to do that, I don't want to do that. I want strong energies, I want more damage. Yeah, there it is. Oof. Okay, so this attack is now 240 plus another 40. So 280 damage. That's a knockout. But we will do that with Guzma on another Pokemon. Not this Pokemon. Field Blower. Yeah, let's Field Blower this. That's it. Alright. Hit and run. Another ball. Curious, so I'll draw two cards and if it's attack team, which is not the case. Very curious. What is he gonna do? He's just thinking now. Oh, he doesn't have healing. Wow, that's unique. Okay, what I'm gonna do now is be aggressive and get that Butterfree dead. Down to the ground. Ah oh, man, we need one more of that. Just one. Okay, you know what? No, 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 that would be stupid. It would be very, very stupid. What I'm gonna do is, uh, I was thinking about using this, but then I would lose 40 damage. So that's not a good, good idea. Hmm, okay, what I'm gonna do is knock out this one. And after that, I can use this Scorching Earth. So that's three prizes already, we're halfway there. We, also, we have another Martial Arts, which is very good news. But that's that won't do much at this point, it'll only give us 10 damage. 
And this one we will have to like two shot anyway, so that poorly damage do doesn't give us a uh, much difference. Should be safe if I flip the tails. Should be. So what I'm gonna do is use this to draw more cards. Okay, we have a Cynthia. I can't use this. That's very, very, very sad. So yeah, I'm gonna attach that there. Let's see what happens. So we have a strong energy again. We're gonna attach this to him. I feel like that's a good idea. We'll use this, because if that's, if we're gonna have a hit flipper hats, we will get a knockout. Please flip a hats. We don't. Now that's sad. Very sad, but alright. I'll have to deal with it. So he heals from that Pokemon. We're gonna have to deal with that Hikmonchan, man. So he knocks it out. He did put his butterfree there. Hmm. Okay, what I'm gonna do is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do that. And also, I'm very be I'm being very, very dumb. Because <laughs> I put this there and there, but I can't uh, actually do it there. I'm not gonna use this yet. I'm gonna wait. We're gonna do see if it's 70 damage. Switch into this doll. 70 damage should do. Cause we can boost our damage to 40 again. But the only downside to that is that we don't actually do much. Like we don't We don't uh, switch out, that's what I meant. We don't switch out after doing that. Here's the Cynthia to look for something. Hmm. I did have another version of this deck running something like Muscular Band to boost our damage with even 20 more for the hit one chance. Okay, so we did something pretty useless, I guess. I guess you could say that. Oh wow, okay, so we get ourselves another doll. This is our last doll, so I know. Okay, great, so. He still needs to kill a lot. So it's a kill uh, three Pokemon. Okay, he's gonna use Lysander to kill one of these. Ah, Diancy. Ouch. Now that hurts. That does hurt indeed. At this point, we'll mainly have to go attacking. I suppose. I suppose. gonna do is be aggressive and attack completely 150 damage eh? 150 if he didn't heal that much then he would have been dead so yeah It. Well, at this point, I think it's game then. 
Yep. Well, well played. Because I don't have enough power to actually knock this out now. No, I don't. No, that's just up. Yeah. Don't have enough power. Well, that was pretty good top deck, to be honest. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. How much damage do we do? So we need 80. 10 damage. 30. 20. Ah, oh, we don't do enough, man. We don't do enough. We just don't. Ah, oh, that's so frustrating. Because he killed Diancy. So frustrating. We're missing out on 20 damage. And that's what this Diancy would give us. Oh, wait, what? 90? What for? Wait, wait, so that's 50. Oh my god, yeah, it's 40, it's not 10, because we have more cards. Oh my god, well played. Lol, I, did, I just miscounted this. I, I miscounted that's 40. That's already 40 damage from this. Oh my god, damn, man. That was a great top deck. <laughs> that top deck won us the game. God damn. He did a lot of damage, even though it's not a damage damage counter game. It's not a damage map uh, deck. Okay, so we did actually win. Damn, wasn't expecting that, lads. 